Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars Adventure in Imperion Galactic Survival. Okay, so what are we going to be doing today? Hmm? Well, I think we need to head back towards our ship here, which is all the way across the planet. Would it be faster go just carrying on? Nah, the planet is very large, so we'll head back. And we're going to kind of go back the way we came. Just kind of hop on this. Maybe hop over here, swim over here. Back to this island and kind of run back. That's the plan. And maybe I'll show you, maybe not. But welcome everybody back to the you know, this video series. And hopefully you'll enjoy the ride. Don't forget your drink and your tasty treat. Oh, really? What is that? Oh yeah, they added these. These are new. I don't know if they're hostile. Yo, hello. Are you hostile? These probably give a lot of meat. Oh, I definitely want to kill one eventually. <laughs> definitely. Cobra leaves. Oh, shoot. Did you see that? Huh. I'm going to uh, build some. Um, oops. <sighs> wow. That guy spawned in. Like. Weird. Because we, sh we shot one, if you remember. Right? Holy crap. I definitely want some of this stuff. Um, bullets aren't really important. So we'll make sure we take those. Um, we can always build a rocket launcher, so again, this is not really priority. And I don't even have rockets to use anyways, you'd have to make those, so we'll, we'll get rid of that. The metal pieces, they take iron. The fiber, we can always pick up off the ground, no big deal. Okay, it sucks having to make those kind of decisions, but yeah, maybe this thing will stay here, and we'll come back and you loot the rest of it. Um, I'm I'm headed towards the iron deposit because I want to I want to do some iron, cobalt, copper. Yeah, I want to harvest some iron here. But do I have enough room for iron? Actually, copper, cobalt, neodymium, iron ore. Yeah, we know we have a spot for iron, so I definitely want to loot some iron. And then I want to run around picking up some stuff. Um, how are we gonna eat? Yeah, that's interesting. I guess we could use this O2 bottle up. Huh. I guess we'll have to discover that when we when we get to it. That's this. That's probably something I uh, use. Uh, the tower? Yeah, the tower would have created that. So, uh, for these aliens' towers, I know there's three versions of them. So we've encountered version 2. Version one's across the way. There's another one over down over there that you can see. Uh, I don't want that gun, I want this gun. Way down there. Oh, if you zoom in. There's another one over here. Let's see here, iron. Iron deposit, there we go. Uh, oh, I do have coffee beans, so we can pick up some coffee, but that's okay. Doesn't matter. Here we go, we're coming up to the iron here. I was thinking of hitting that Promethium deposit again, but I'd probably it'd probably be better to fly. So let's see here. Some more dinosaurs over there. I wonder if they're gonna add other kinds of dinosaurs, right? If they're gonna add like T Rexes, Velociraptors and all kinds of stuff like that. It'd be kinda neat. So they've also done an update with the, the the vehicles requiring less fuel to to operate. Let's mine downward here. Ooh, this 
hole. I gotta remember. We don't want to create a situation. I think this is the iron now, maybe. Oh, what? Pick up what? Oh, uh, no. Crushed stone. Okay. Um, let's see here. Let's make sure my jetpack's on. Are we able to get out? Yes, we are. Okay. Let's dig down from here a little bit. Maybe we just kind of have a way down. Ah, uh, here we go. I think we're hitting it now. This is kind of dark gray stuff here. Let's see here. Yeah, this stuff here, kind of with the, the brown in it. I think, maybe? Let's see here. Kind of, sort of, yeah, okay, look, there's a bunch in here. How much iron? We got 30 iron? Yeah, we're gonna come back. This is what it, this is all it's about. It's about you mining and, oh, come on. Uh, this, is, uh, this is why we gotta dig kind of a better way down. Kind of like this. That way we can get out, alright? Just a series of jumps to get out. Perfect. That's pretty cool. Let's uh, grab our machine gun, because that's the one I like the most. Which way are we headed now? So we need to head... Uh, where are we going? Where's the ship? Oh, there's the ship right here. You can barely see it with the, the light. Um, so... We need to head towards this copper deposit. Well, sort of. We need to stick to the right here to follow this kind of beach area. So, I'll tell you what, folks. When I get back to the ship, we will return. So, I'll see you then. Well, here we are. We are back. Back from that tower. And we're back at our ship. And we're going to try and see if we can get things operational. Let's go into our constructor here. So there's a bunch of stuff in here already. Let's throw in our metal pieces, those, those, computers. Oh man, it's so nice to have all these materials here. Glass plates, all these bars. Uh, what about pellets, some plastic raw material. Of course we're gonna, some magnesium powder, cobalt ore, crushed stone, metal parts, neodymium ore copper ore, magnesium, silicon, oh, there we go, uh, let's see here, I think, oh, and this stuff, the promethium ore, so, promethium ore uses one, so we can do 39 times, so 10, 20, 30, 9, 39, is this on even? Is the ship on? see gotcha there now it's producing um let's see here how about this stuff so magnesium ore that's gonna make magnesium powder so we can make a couple of those it should make 10 looks like silicone ore uh, where are we 5, 10, 15. We can put a couple copper. 1, 2. Looks like neodymium. A couple neodymium. 30. So looks like. So what? Um, set, uh, 5 times 5. So 5 times 6 is 30, I think. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Uh, let's see here. Crushed stone. We can make rock dust out of that. Bang, bang. Okay. That's how you make more mining stuff. Cobalt ore. 16. Uh, let's see. 5, 10, 15. Okay. Sathium. Sacosium. Erestrum. That's cool. We'll have to find those at some point. Uh, let's see. 
corn and rock dust. We need to find corn somewhere. So we got these plant materials here that don't go bad. Let's throw them into here. Um, we'll put the alien stuff in there too. Yeah, we definitely need to make a base because we need to make first aid kits. You don't make first aid kits in here at all. I know we need to make more ammo, so we need more metal pieces. Because I'm out of ammo, so where's metal pieces here? Um, metal pieces, where are we? I need these things. So, 10. So, 10, 20, 30, 40 maybe? We got lots of iron, so we'll be okay. Um, what else? What else can we build here? I think we need to build eight blocks so that we can build a base starter. Because we need a base. We need to start building a base. We need eight hull blocks. So metal plates. We've got 16 metal plates. I think that's eight. All right. Eight times two is 16. Seven, eight. Okay, perfect. Um, and then we can build thrusters, right? What kind of thrusters can we build through this this thing here? Let's take a quick oh, look at that. It got a couple of kinds of doors. One for oh, one for ships. Maybe we should make a ship big enough to have the door. That'd be kind of cool. Portable work light. That's kind of neat. Food processor. Hover engine. Um, oh, so we do need. A, we can't build thrusters for this thing for the space vehicle for small vessels, huh? Looks like we would have to build a base to do that. And I don't know if I want to do that. I don't know. Wanna, I don't know if I want to build the base here, or if I build the base somewhere else. Hmm. Let's take a quick peek around here. It's going to be dark as heck. Um. I don't know. I don't know if I like the spot here that we're in. I guess we could just build the base right here, and who cares? Um, yeah, maybe we'll just build the base right here. What does it matter, right? Right here. Maybe we'll make it up in the air. I don't know. Maybe we'll try and make it a little bit different. So, we basically need eight blocks. And, yeah. So, I'm going to speed this up, and I'll see you at the end. I'm going to throw some music to it, I think. And, yeah, I'll see you there. Perfect. Here we go. We're back. Oh, excuse me. I'm taking a bite out of a burger here. Apologize for that. Figured it'd be a good opportunity to eat. Now you're hearing me smack my mouth and yum, yum, yum. <laughs> That's why I tell you to grab your drinks and your tasty treats, right? So, here we go. We're going to carry on. 
Okay, well we did that. So now let's build the base, the base constructor thingy. Where's that? That's in here, I think. Here we go. Base starter. And then, hmm, where do I want to place the materials? And I want to create kind of like a stairwell up, right? So, hmm, we need to make some plates metal plates here 10 20 30 40 don't want too many we need to go harvest um, how's our charges we got eight drill charges one filler flattened charge and so we're okay on the charges we don't need that we should make some more fuel packs that's uh, for sure so let's build 10 of those guys as well Okay, and let's see here. We need. I want to build some ramps because that's the only way. Excuse me, that's the only way to kind of do stairs, right? So let's see here. Yeah, might as well. Let's try these ramps. Um, gonna need. Just gonna need this one to get into the base. Then we're gonna need. One, two, three, four. Okay, perfect. Uh, so what that's going to do is that's going to allow us to go up, and then we need to build a bunch of these blocks, I guess. Um, how many plates? Two plates again? So what? Uh, so eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 30, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So you can do 10 more of these. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I think we'll do something like that. Because I want to kind of create a platform and then kind of go from there. So let's grab these things. Do you need to make a large constructor? How do we make one of those? Computer control, electronics. Cables, motor, pipes, which we collected. So let's make a large constructor right away. Because we're going to need that. Um, and then we'll need to make a food processor. That's the next important aspect of all this stuff. Because this is what's going to allow you to create food. Then we need a fuel tank. And then we'll need a generator right here this one and so let's see here as soon as it starts doing the large constructor we'll see what we have left because based on that we'll determine uh, let's see here oh, okay okay so let's do we need food processor as well because that's how we make food and then we need to make a fridge uh, but the fridge looks like that's only for the, the ship I don't see well because we need large constructor so maybe what we'll do is we'll make what we can from this constructor so once this one's done we will try and build our base here together yeah I think that's what we'll do let's grab some of these fuel packs here grab those uh, large construct. We still have to kind of click and drag. I can't use my scroll wheel for that. I'll have to fix that. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, perfect. So, really don't have much of anything else at the moment. But we will need to make a generator control device, too. So, we'll need to hit another tower, unfortunately. We need some food as well. So, let's do some hunting here. Or, no, here we go. Let's go grab some of these corn dogs. Let's go grab that one. I see a corn dog up here. Let's go grab that one. Okay, uh, where else? Do I see any more? Yeah, right there. Straight ahead and then to the right there, there's one. Okay, and then there was one over here somewhere. Ah, there's, a, ah, there's more than one. There's this one. Oh, hello! <laughs> 
So what, 14 shots? Yeah, 14, 13 shots. Uh, let's see, Lucha. Ah, cool, so that's, you get plant fiber from those guys, that's pretty useful. A, a renewable resource. <laughs> but I think this stuff all grows back anyways, so not a big deal. Let's throw this all up in my hot bar. Let's eat some food here. And eat some more food. So why we need our base, right? So that we can start collecting meat. Start uh, rolling in the food. So that way we're not stuck here all the time. Um, we need the space flight achieved on our our space vehicle here, or our small vessel, whatever you want to call it. So let's eat these. We need to find some more corn dogs, unfortunately. I see, I think I see one over there. Now why these are called corn dogs is I think because they're edible for one, and two, they remind me of like the cattails or whatever you want to call them. They're in swamps and you can actually eat that stuff as well, right? You can kind of grill it you over a campfire and and bon appetit, right? Because a lot of the Native Americans did that. So, yeah. So that's kind of what this reminds me of. They just call it a corn dog because they thought it'd be cool, but it's a plant that you know they've named as corn dog. What would be neat if if they could have like a discovery layer to the game, where say you found this plant, well now you can name it, and then all the other plants would be named that name, right? Instead of having a precondition name you have it where you can name the discovery you know the discovery so instead of like a cobra plant you could call this you know, something else right um, you know you could call a reptile plant or something and and it would recognize that and then it would tell you in the crafting components and everything that you need you know, you know this material and I think it'd be neat if people had you know a different names for the materials just so that way if you did PvP and stuff like that, it'd be kind of neat and unique. But same note, I, I completely understand why they do it the way they do. Excuse me. So yeah, that's just interesting. Let's grab the, the fibers here, which we need for something. Let's see, let's put our food up here. Let's see. Let's put these away. Let's put this in the hot bar. We need the ramps. Okay, where are we gonna put the base? Mm. I wanna put it right here, maybe. So we need to flatten the ground, I think. Yeah, so this is what the flattener is for. Um, I think it's right click to flatten. Let's take a look, just in case. Fill is left mouse button, flatten is right mouse button. So let's fill this a bit and then we can flatten right okay and then I think we can choose this again and hopefully it's green oh 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 I want it facing kind of which way towards that tower that we were at Let's see here, come on. Come on. Okay, let's flatten this some more. Okay. Perfect. Doesn't need to be perfect, just enough to allow you to place it, just like so. And we'll go like this. Left click, is it? Bang! New base! Whoa. Okay. So now, I need to use my jetpack here, fly up here. Okay, so we want to basically come into the base and then have to take stairs going up. Um, how do we want to position these stairs? Because we're going to use these ramps to do it. Let's see here. Hmm. Come walking in. Go here to the corner, go up. Um, let's place the 
blocks over here. We might have to make another trip to the tower, but I'm just going to use these blocks. I'm not going to use the interior blocks on this base because I need to keep this base as simple as possible. Um, we can remove things, right, after we place them. So if I put this there, like this, and then put another ramp right here. Um, how do we rotate end? Yeah, another ramp here. All right, up, and then we need to place, position another one of these up here. Ah, actually, this kind of works, doesn't it? Okay, we want to walk up here, and we want to walk up here. Whoa, shoot. Okay, and then we want to go up yet again. <laughs> Okay. Let's see here. Let's see what this looks like. Go up like this. Okay, and then uh, maybe this will be the last bit going up. Maybe like that, and then up top would be this would be the base layer up here. Um, let's see here, the base layer, like the the layer that you walk on. Um, so let's see here. Physics are kind of funny on these ramps, but that's to be expected. Um, like this. Okay, let's jump off. Use jetpack last minute. I think we can place them like this. So I, I need to place. So this is the outside wall. Let's place that. Okay, so that's going to be an outside wall. And the door is going to be right in the middle of this block. So that means we can position this guy like so. And then we can position this guy like so. There we go. Now we have a ramp going up into our place here. Um, I do want... Well, there's going to be a wall basically on the outside of this, right? Um, let's see here, if I place these blocks like so, might have to replace them out. Um, okay, we come in. I guess there can't be a door here, because I put these in the wrong spot. Well, I guess we'll have to remove them. Let's do remove and repair tool. Four. Tab four. Uh, right click, I think, to remove. That's. No, left mouse button. Right click to repair. So I have to tear this up, unfortunately. And we've got to repair this. <clears throat> and I need to make more blocks. So let's see, let's let's see how many more we can make, and then I think we're gonna call it an episode here pretty quick. Um, so I got some those some metal plates back, but we need more. So we need to make five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty. 45, 50. We do need a lot of plates, and we can get more irons. So it's not a big deal, right? Um, and then we want to make a bunch of these. So let's make. That we'll use 20. Um, we don't need more ramps. We need to build this one and this one again, unfortunately. So one of each, and a door. What do we need for a door? Two electronics, one control device. And control devices, what do they need to be made with? One cobalt, copper, silicone. Hmm. I don't know what to say to that one.
Hmm. Sorry, I apologize for that. It was quiet there. I was just thinking as I was reducing how many uh, of these we were making. Because I don't think we need that many. Because we only use a few plates each time, right? So I, I miscounted <laughs> severely on that one. Severely. Um, okay. I don't know if I want to build the door yet. I do want a door, but... Yeah, let's grab these blocks here. Let's let's give this a shot again. Uh, we can grab these again. Okay, perfect. That's the remove and repair tool. Maybe we can replace that one with the the filler. Um, then we got this one. Okay, let's get back to it. Let's see here. So this is the outside, right? So that means we want to create this block, this block, this block. So this would be the entrance. Okay, and then let's put this down again. Try this again. And then this one. But unfortunately, if you notice the ground... Ah, actually it's not too bad. We have access into our place here. Okay, let's just build up some more of these a little bit. I just don't know how I want to build it up. So we'll just we'll kind of get an idea where the outside wall is. That's the outside wall. All right. This is the outside wall, I think. Yeah. And then we have an outside wall on this side as well somewhere. Um, where should we put it? It's, ah, we need more, more bricks, more blocks. So, we come in. I'm going to tear this out, I think. Because it doesn't make sense to have this here. Um, neither does this block, technically. But we need some block to stand on, so unfortunately that has to stay there. Maybe what we can do is we can put the generator right here in, in here. And maybe the fuel cell right here, and then we can run up. So yeah, so there we go, folks. Let's kind of climb up to the top of our tower here, and we'll call it a day with the sunset on Akua. I think that's the name of the planet. <laughs> so yeah, so there we go, folks. So we had... An interesting day coming back to our, our base here, starting our base build, and yeah. Thank you everybody for watching. Hopefully you've enjoyed this episode, and when you come back I'll have more of this done. Um, I won't do too much of it, but basically that's how I do to build. I kind of start establishing the parameters, and I build up from there. So thank you everybody for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next episode. Bye-bye.